Hello and welcome back to The Average. This video is sponsored by BetterHelp, so thank you so much for sponsoring this video and making it happen. Today we are looking at this watercolor paint box because it's moisturizing, apparently. <laughs> I didn't see that until just now. Moisturizing, because I want to do, well, I want to make my own set of colors with this jelly gouache that I have, because I have two massive palettes of jelly gouache. And what I want to do is because I'm moving and these are going to be in boxes for a while. <laughs> Why have I got blue paint on me already? How did that happen? Okay, anyway, um, I want to make my own little traveler's pack, you may say. And also it'd be fun. Ooh, that's kind of cool as well. A little handy holding device. Completely distracted. Also it comes with this little scrapey tool, I think. Which helps you scrape stuff off. I'm not sure why, but it's handy, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say it's pretty damn handy. I've got all these colours. I've got <laughs> too many, as we all know. Look at that, looking good. Needs a little bit of a spritz. These are doing quite well. Sometimes they get a little bit like gross. I don't know if I want to use both of them. I think I do because these ones have like some metallics in them as well, which would be fun. This video is in paid partnership with BetterHelp. Is something interfering with your happiness or preventing you from achieving your goals? If you have any issues like depression or anxiety, or if you're just a person that lives in this difficult world and trying to navigate through it, then therapy can give you the tools to approach your life in a different way. And that's why I'm excited to tell you about BetterHelp. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy accessible and this is an important mission because finding a therapist can be hard. BetterHelp is a platform that makes finding a therapist easy because it's online, it's remote, and just by filling out a few questions, BetterHelp can match you with a credentialized therapist in as little as a few days. It's easy to sign up and get matched with a therapist. There's a link in my description. It's betterhelp.com forward slash average artist. Clicking that link helps support this channel, but it also gives you 10% off your first month of BetterHelp so you can connect with a therapist and see if it helps you. And because finding a therapist is sometimes difficult and it doesn't always fit quite common to find that you might want to change your therapist so you can easily switch to a different therapist at no additional cost so if you're struggling consider online therapy with better help click the link in the description or visit betterhelp.com forward slash average artist thank you again to better help for supporting this channel i've either lost or packed my little spritzy bottle so i'm just gonna use an old bottle of water one's a dry just a little glob of water in some of them. One's dry, you're dry. It's like watering plants. I'm alive, my pretties. This looks fine. What I've got, this is gonna intrigue you guys because it's just so clever. Some chopsticks from a Chinese takeaway I had the other night. And uh, I'm gonna use them to mix the paints instead of a palette knife because I can't find those either. I think I've packed them, which is so clever of me. It's just really clever of me. Isn't that beautiful? I'm going to look up some colour palettes, I think, online and just use those because there's going to be so many nice ones. And I want to do like a pastel mood board. These ones are cute, but it's only like four colours, so I'll have to figure it out. Let's do pinks first. I'll just revive this one a little bit. So I'm going to put it in. I feel like I need a little spoon or something. Maybe my little picker. This little picker could work. Okay, let's try the picker. <laughs> the picker, that's not a way, that's not a thing, but... Is it gonna fit satisfyingly or is it just gonna like not work? There's a hair. It's an eyelash. Make a wish. I wish that you I could describe. <laughs> that was so cheesy. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry about myself. Oh, awful. Okay. Ooh, the scrapey is good. I'm liking the scrapey. There we go. There we go. Look at that. I think you need like just a little bit more to like I really want it to be like topped up to the brim so it looks beautiful and then I want to like wipe the top because I'm gonna be really like dainty about this because I really want it to look nice in the palette which is really unimportant but there we go moving on to the next color choice da -da 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 -da. something that goes with this but I kind of want to mix I mean that is nice and that is nice but I want pastel so I don't know should I mix my own let's see huh squeaking no one I feel like it's impossible to not get messy during this process I'm really trying I wanted to make it uh, more pastel sometimes when <laughs> paint falls into other paint I just mix it the ratio is so like 
minimal but it works out sometimes oh so satisfying when it like just mm. so let's see if this works i don't know why i want just pastels i feel like that could be just a vibe why am i speaking like that <laughs> Literally lost the little scraper thing now. <laughs> what the hell? Where's it gone? Okay, I really just, I do want to just, just get this like, so it's really full. There we go, two colors down. Next color, what are we gonna pick? I think we need like another pinky color, I guess. And we're gonna mix again, but using this pot again. So I'm gonna just grab some more white. There we go, and I'm just gonna mix it. And hope for the best because what is art it's fun so we're supposed to have fun with our supplies all right so i think the next part of this is that i'm going to make a montage of me filling up these and uh wish me luck because i feel like this took me a solid 10 minutes to do <laughs> but let's see let's see where we get to and once i'm done i'm going to paint something with this so stick around and find out There we go. There is the final palette. It's all kind of pastel. Feel like I got the colors slightly out of order because I was just going for it and it took forever. But there we go, that's what it looks like. And I've put extra whites at the bottom because I know I always need white. I hope that this is gonna be a fun palette to use on the go. Let's just seal it up and see what it looks like all together. The lid is dirty now, of course, because that's the way it goes. So let's just seal it up if I can. I've done this wrong. Oh god. Let's try again. Okay, this is the wide side. No, this is the wide side. There we go. Here's the palette. Um, you can see here where I try to mix it inside the actual palette, but it was still fun. Oh my gosh, it looks cute with the cover on it as well. Let me just tidy away and we'll get to painting with this, my new palette. Oh yeah, I painted this with oils a couple years ago now. It was my first attempt at oils and uh, I hate it. So I want to go over gouache on top of it. I don't know if that's necessarily a good idea, but it is completely dry. It's been two years, so I don't see how it could really affect the paint underneath. Not necessarily change this, but just improve it and i think this is a really nice palette to do it with this was kind of the inspiration color for the palette as well because i knew that i was wanting to do something with this painting and well let's see how it goes Baby. 
Here's the final piece. I probably could work on this forever and who knows, maybe in a couple years I'll paint over this again and redo it. But here is the palette. It's a little bit messy now, but that's always bound to happen. But it was really nice and I can't wait to use this on the go. And here's the painting. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, please like and subscribe as always. It really helps me out. If you like this video or share it with someone you think will like it, that'll be awesome. Thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. Okay, that's it. Thank you. Bye.